Four dogs died recently after being left out in the heat with another death still under investigation. Now the Nebraska Humane Society warns if you take your pets outside, keep them cool or you'll be fined. Reporter John Madden rode along with NHS today and has more on what you need to do to be a responsible pet owner during these hot temps. Well, Animal Services has been busy all summer long, not only responding to dogs being left in hot cars, but also animals being left out in the heat, which without the proper shade and water can be the biggest enemy for man's best friend. It's another busy day for Misty Bino. Oh, you're hot. As she's checking on a dog that's known to be left outside. We're going to give him some water. This dog's water dish is flipped over, and in 90 plus degree heat, no access to water can have severe consequences. Definitely a possible situation where this owner will be cited for animal cruelty. Bino expects the dog to be okay, but four other dogs and possibly a fifth were not so lucky recently. They can go through heat exhaustion and then heat stroke and die within a matter of minutes in severe heat. While dogs being left in hot cars continues to be an issue, dogs being left in hot yards has been a bigger problem for the Nebraska Humane Society. And I think that people don't realize how hot it can get in a yard. If you decide to leave your dog outdoors, there's a few things to keep in mind. If you put your pet out in the yard, he needs to be able to have access to ventilated shade and also have plenty of cool, fresh water the entire time that he's outside. Those two things are key, and since dogs don't sweat to cool themselves down, having that shade is important. The way that dogs cool down is to suck in cooler air and to pant out hot air. If there's no cooler air for them to suck in, if there's no way for them to get into shade and find cooler air, they can't cool their core body temperature down. The Humane Society expects to receive more calls this summer, so they urge pet owners to leave their furry friends at home where it's cool and also want the public to give them a call if they see a pet in distress. On several cases where animals didn't die, we were able to take quick action because someone noticed it and they called us right away. In Omaha, John Madden, 3 News Now. NHS also warns don't leave your pet in a hot car. The heat rises so quickly and your pet can die much faster. If you see a pet in distress, call Animal Control. That number is on your screen.